last year that he was saying that Magnus really likes these structures of the exchange Carl, like the Carlsbad pawn structures. Yes, and we have the games. Okay, good news. Then, okay, right into Magnus versus Richard Rapport. Rapport played e5 early on, so we're not... Well, in the Karo Khan. Mm -hmm. In the Karo Khan, because you said early on e5. Early on. Uh, yes, <laughs> if we don't know when. Yeah, it was e4, c6. Yeah, uh, a typical from uh, Rapport. Oh, wow. And then... There's a pawn sacrifice already on the board from Richard. I mean, this 94 move offering up the d5 pawn for the bishop pair compensation. I mean, I, I would agree that there's definitely good compensation if white takes that knight. Oh, so let's put rook e3 on the board. Yeah, so this is the line takes. we are discussing because it's forced and it's a total horror. After king d3, the key move mentioned by Miro, bishop f2. Maybe many other things are also good, but this wins on the spot. There is no defense against rook e3. And Jan looking at uh, Magnus. Is it correct? It's, it's right what I'm seeing, but uh, Richie took on B2 mm -hmm. instead. Which isn't terrible. <laughs> oh, wow. And, and the resignation. Wow, what a, a huge result. Yeah, huge result. What a win, what a performance by Richard Lapol. He shocked Magnus Carlsen right from the oh, opening. I think the problem also is on Queenie 2, there's rook takes E3. Yes. Let's just show that line.